Hi, welcome to Shop Stop. Today we want to talk a little bit about vacuum cleaners as well as being able to compare items based on what you think you need uh, when you're looking to purchase something. Take for example a wet and dry vac for your shop. You want to look at tank size, you want to look at, at uh, what you're going to be doing with it, but the main thing is it's not going to pick up anything unless it moves air. So the big thing is, is you know, what, how many cubic feet per minute will it pull, or what kind of vacuum level will it pull? And uh, that information is probably going to be hard to come by. Yeah, it may have a peak horsepower rating, it may have an amperage rating, but that has nothing to do with moving air. That has more to do with the motor than actually what, what the vacuum is doing. So the higher the CFM it's moving, the better you're going to do vacuuming. So you're probably going to have to do a little bit more digging to find that information. It's not going to be on the plate. It's probably not going to be in, in, uh, on the display at the store. It's, it's, you're going to have to look a little deeper if you want to find that vacuum. That's probably the best deal. Yeah, you may have to get on the internet and look at reviews and see what people are saying about certain vacuums and, and even noise levels too because some of them are so loud it's hard to be in the same room with them. So do a little bit of research. Do a little bit more digging when you're looking at, at purchasing that piece of equipment for the shop. That's it this week on Shop Stop. We'll see you next time.